Space Shuttle Endeavor made 25 trips to space, but now that it's retired, its home is in Southern California. And it's part of the California Science Center, considered to be one of the best of its kind anywhere. In tonight's Look at This, KKL's Dem Desmond Shaw takes us to Exposition Park. I'll take a look at this super cool museum in Exposition Park. This is the California Science Center. So the museum goes back to the 1950s. The original building, though, actually goes back to 1912 when it was the state exposition building, and it would display agricultural products and industrial resources. Then at the focus turned to science in the 1950s. But in the 1980s, things really began to change when museum leadership developed a 25-year master plan spread across three different phases to totally transform this into a lot more than a museum. This was the first phase, this huge building that has two uh, huge exhibit halls as well as an IMAX theater. In 2011, they added a 200,000 gallon kelp tank, part of their living ecosystem exhibition, very up close and personal. Perhaps the coolest though, inside here, the Samuel Ocean Pavilion sits the Space Shuttle Endeavor after its memorable final flight on the back of a 747 across the state and that really cool parade through LA city streets. This is its final resting place inside here. This is ET-94, the last surviving external fuel tank from the Space Shuttle uh, program. And the plan is to actually attach that to the Endeavor. And once they do that, they will have the world's only working or complete space shuttle system with real hardware. Now, aviation fanatics are also going to love this place. For one, we have an F-18A Hornet that sits right out here in front of the original building. And one of my favorite planes, often mistaken for an SR-71, this is actually an A-12, which was the forerunner to that amazing plane. Uh, this is also the only A-12 trainer ever built and flew more hours than any other A-12 ever did. They have several other aircraft uh, on display inside the museum halls as well. So much to see, do, and learn here. It will be hard to do it all in one day. Open from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. every day of the week. CaliforniaScienceCenter.org to learn more. Taking a look at this from Sky9, I'm Desmond Shaw. And if you'd like Desmond to take a look at something interesting in your neighborhood, just write us at look at this at cbs.com.